you know, every year around Christmas time, I have the same conversation with my mom. Andy, what do you want for Christmas? And I tell her, hey, I really don't want anything. And we go back and forth for a while. I pretty much have what I want, what I need. I don't really need anything. And she'll eventually get out of me something that I, that I want. What I've learned over the years is really what my mom wants is the blessing of giving. She gets a, a greater joy out of giving than receiving. There's certainly some scripture to back this idea up. In, in the book of Acts chapter 20, uh, Paul records some of the words that Jesus says. This is Paul speaking. He says, In everything I showed you that by this kind of hard work we must help the weak, remembering the words of the Lord himself. It is more blessed to give than to receive. We learn in scripture that part of the reason, and in fact the reason, that God gives us gifts, that God blesses us, is so that we can be a blessing to others. These spiritual gifts that we obsess over in 1 Corinthians, all of them are given as a blessing for the church. In fact, Paul says in 1 Corinthians chapter 12, they are given for the edification, mutual edification of the body. So why do you want to be blessed? Is it so you can have things, or is it ultimately so that you can give? I'm here to tell you this morning that if you want the Lord's blessing, if you want to receive the type of blessing that the Lord offers you, the way that you'll do that is by giving, not by receiving. The Lord is more blessed to give than to receive. In Matthew chapter 6, Jesus talks about the reward that people receive Whenever they give to be seen by others, they have received their reward in full. What I want you to hear from me this morning, what I want to encourage you with this morning, is don't look to be blessed simply so you can have. But if you want the Lord's blessing, find it by giving. And to put it plainly, if you do not want to be blessed by giving, then it is not the Lord's blessing that you want but your own. Church, I love you. I pray that the Lord will protect you and keep you safe. Have a blessed day.